Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that from the figure, find the congruent triangles and state which of the rigid motions are needed to match the corresponding vertices of the triangles and explain why the triangles are congruent. Now let us start with the solution of the given question. Now in the given figure, we are given two triangles, that is triangle EAB and triangle ECD. And here we are given that side AE is equal to side CE and side BE is equal to side DE and here we have to prove that the two triangles are congruent that is we have to prove that triangle EAB is congruent to triangle ECD now let us start with its proof. Now in triangle EAB and triangle ECD, side AE is equal to side CE, that is line segment AE is equal to line segment CE, and this is given. And here, Angle AEB is equal to angle CED because they are vertically opposite angles so they have same measure and we write angle AEB is equal to angle CED because they are vertically opposite angles and side BE is equal to side DE that is, line segment BE is equal to line segment DE and it is given to us. Now, since the two sides and the included angle are equal for the pair of triangles, so by side angle side congruence, the two triangles are congruent. So we write by side angle side that is by SAS congruence triangle EAB is congruent to triangle ECD. And now we find the rigid motion needed to match the vertices that is the corresponding vertices of the two triangles. Now to match the corresponding vertices of the triangles, we rotate triangle EAB about vertex E. Then the vertices of triangle EAB match the vertices of triangle ECD. So, the rigid motion needed to match the corresponding vertices of the triangles is rotation. And this is the solution of the given question. That's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.